This is starting to get really, really intense, guys. I really gotta be careful. I'm out of escape dolls. So if I die again, I lose. This is BSL, Bolt Spinningles are back once again. Welcome to the next part of Let's Play Fantasy Star Universe. Question is, what's about to happen? God damn it. Gotcha. I guess this means now I'm on my own. I am without Karen. This is not the place for me to be on my own, though. Central control room. And there's a cutscene. Now we just need to destroy this. Magashi. Magashi! I have been waiting for you. Magashi, how can you be alive? You have followed my plans perfectly. I knew you would rush over here if we used your friends as bait. Magashi! You'll die once and for all! <laughs> this is where your corpse will rot! <laughs> <laughs> Face of the intro. That's how you do it, Ethan. But remember what happened last time we put a sword through my shoes. And somehow they got out. We didn't destroy the thing yet, if I'm not mistaken, but somehow they got out. How's that logical? Yeah, knew it. <laughs> this ain't over. There are still two missing achievements. You can't escape. What? I'll say that in a more evil war. You can't escape. Yeah, knew it. It's another boss I fought before. This is Doc Focus. The final boss. Let's go! Is he gonna. Yeah! Let's go, Makashi. I'm taking you out here and now. I forgot. I forgot what the hell he does. I'm kinda low on healing on him, but at least I have my partners. Let's go, let's kill. He's about to fire a laser. Oh no, they're pushing me back. This, it doesn't do any damage to you, I know that much. It just pushes you backwards. Well, something just did damage to me, I see that much. And that shield, I believe... Well, watch it. I'm just gonna use that, and that's gonna... Maybe it's gonna try and push me back. Like I said, I fought this boss online before. I do know this is the final boss of the game. Kinda. 
Alright, step back forward. If he puts that shield back on himself. Watch it. That's the laser. Yes, yes, you already know. I already know how to fight Dog Focus. But still, careful, because I do not have any more escape dolls. So I die, it's over. And stop putting up that fucking shield. I guess I should take with my bow. I'm not damn what's he doing? Why can't I damage him with the bow? Fuck. Back up. Can't damage him in the ball at all with the bow? Fuck. Is there anything I can do? What do you mean where'd I go? Where else can I go? Can I can't I Damage it at all. Well, then stop putting up that damn shield, Moxie. Laser. It's gonna put me back. No, the laser. Let's keep firing at him then. Now he's gonna put me back in. No, not the laser. Then just keep firing the fire spell. Let me put up the shield. This is where it ends. This is where I end this game. This is where I defeat you once and for all. I believe if you get far enough into this fight, he's gonna start start firing a bunch of spells from these new arms that he gets. You can keep doing that all you want, Magashi. I'm just fine with that. As long as I got the safe spot here from that attack. Like I said, I believe I cannot damage him at all when he has that shield up. I'll wait a moment to see if he tries to put it back up. What's, what's he doing? Oh crap, he's starting to launch magic. Yeah, keep your eyes on those tentacles. Shoot! And there's a reason I keep getting close to him. Keep getting close to him in the case he puts up that shield because of that arm. If I'm not mistaken, if you're really far away from him when he casts the shield, he's gonna thrust that arm right into you and it's gonna hurt. Now he's pushing me back. I can tell by the noise. Watch out for those that are pushing me back again. Okay, so I can damage him during if I aim for the arms. It's pushing me back. I believe if you're facing that th thing from behind, that then that thing can can damage you. All right, let's try to get back in. There's the laser. It's almost over, guys. Yes. Gotcha. <laughs> Take that, may you die forever. 
of course. This ain't over! Now let's take on the real final boss. Say hello to Dog Focus 2, the real final boss of the game and probably the much harder of them. I've also fought this boss online before, so I know how he works. Not saying he's not bullcrap or hard. Especially since he has one attack with a pretty... Wait, am I damaging him? I can't tell. What's he doing? Oh crap, here's that attack I was just referring to, the meteor. Now, to my knowledge, this attack cannot be dodged. You just gotta pray to God to survive. And it's pretty much guaranteed to burn you. I believe if you're at full health, it can't kill you. But it hurts. So heal immediately. Alright, uh, he's about to, yeah, get away from him. As a matter of fact. Am I hitting multiple parts of his body? So I can kind of stay away from him until he becomes... Whoa. Until he stops moving, then... So I wasn't too sure if I was hurting him with my spells. Alright, he appears to have stopped moving, so let's keep the spell attacks. Okay, that's where they're showing. That's where they're showing. Ow. If I remember, isn't he about to try to charge into me again? Yeah. I'm out of die mates. Put my try mates up. Now, Makshi. Here comes that meteor attack again. I'm at full health. Uh, was. Oh! Did I beat him? Yes! Yes, 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 yes. We did it. It's over. That should be the end of the game. There's the final achievement. Now, let's see what's gonna happen. Again, I fought these two bosses online, so. I do know how they work. We just beat them. That should be endgame. Unless there's an escape sequence! Oh, uh, hi, Lou. <sighs> Please don't make me have to do this whole escape sequence. Just take me to the land deal. Get me the heck out of here, and let's end this game here and now. See the lit? I can't. Oh, it's right there. <laughs> kind of stands out there. So, did they kind of crash land into the, the hive nest or something? Is this the attack? But it blasts! <laughs> it's over. Hi, Kurt. Good job, Ethan. I figured it was you. Thanks for delaying the attack. Don't misunderstand. We were just running a little late. Yeah, right. Thanks. game. I'm pretty sure. I don't think there's anything else past this. <laughs> so my pupils did it as I knew they would. 
They're not your pupils anymore. <sighs> yes, you're right. It's their time, their world now to create anew. With a little hope and faith, maybe they'll lead us into a new era of peace. Perhaps it is now that the true battle begins. Mm. Now what? We killed Mogshi. We destroyed the Seed Hive. There's nothing more to be done, Hivel brothers. <laughs> what are they doing? What, you don't have any- wait, where's Karen? Okay, we'll do. We don't know. We don't need to talk to any more of these bitches anyway. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Cutscene. So there you are, Karen. You just kinda disappeared all of a sudden. <laughs> Sorry. I love to look at the stars. The stars? The sky is so beautiful from here. The stars glitter so peacefully. Yeah, it's beautiful. You know, I was here when the seed first attacked. So much has changed since then. I joined the Guardians and stared danger right in the face. And it's made me realize something. Fighting for the world is really about fighting for the ones you love. Fighting for the ones you love. I feel the same way. Even if I'm not with you, I will always fight for this world. Because you're here in it, Karen. <laughs> So beautiful. So beautiful. Well, that's it, guys. We've done it. After so many unneeded delays and somewhat lack of motivation to an extent. I, BSL Bolt Spinning Lizard, have finally beaten the freaking story mode of Fantasy Star Universe. It's been such a long adventure. So many beautiful moments. Not too much frustration until we got to the freaking hive where we actually started to die quite a bit. Ethan Weber, Force Level 3. Good job. Thank you for helping me through this endeavor of this game. What is there left to do now? This game does have an extra mode, which you unlock after a certain chapter. I can't remember which one it was, but essentially, it's similar to playing online, just uh, except playing offline and with NPCs, where you can create a character, there are free missions you can do. 
Will I ever show it off? For the time being, I'm not going to say I am because everyone knows me and my reputation when it comes to Let's Plays that have like extra content at the end that I never show off after beating a game. So the chances of that are quite slim, I'm just going to say that now. But that's another Let's Play out of the way. Now let us return to Prinny Can I Really Be the Hero with Fairy Fencer F. Enjoy the ending. I'll be right back. back. The credits are still going, but I really don't have much else to say. I've been working on this Let's Play like crazy all week, recording tons of videos and probably my longest recording sessions I've ever had. Hopefully I'll have time to do the same to finish off Pretty Can I Really Be the Hero and continue with Fairy Fencer F, because I actually have not played that game in like a month or so, simply because I... I'm still trying to keep it blind. As thus, I'm not playing the game on my own time unless I'm grinding. Freddy, that game is harder than it looks. <laughs> but I'm still working on it, don't worry. Both these LPs will continue soon. Thank you, Sega, for producing such a nice game. It's not perfect, but I still love it. I just wish you didn't shut down the online servers. If there's ever a way we can bring them back, a private server or something, I'm gonna find it. I'm gonna start playing this game online again. Ah, oh, that was fun! It's finally over! Oh, Ethan, it's not over yet. Huh? What do you mean? This game also has a network mode. What? Really? Well, I didn't know that. You still don't really know much, do you, Ethan? Oh, right, like you know everything. I do. And that's why I'm here to explain the Fantasy Star Universe network mode. Network mode allows the player to make their own characters. Wait, so what happens to me? <laughs> Same as me. We both become sub-characters. What? That's ridiculous! I'm the hero! You just don't get it, Ethan. In network mode, everyone gets to be the hero. Really? Participants all get to be guardians, taking part in the fight against the seed all over the Garal system. So then, everyone gets to be a guardian and they get to help us? Yes. 
And Ethan, you're only one person. We'd be fine without you. Hey, watch it, buddy. Network mode doesn't just continue the story. It also allows for item crafting, selling and trading, and other customizable options. And communication is important, too. You can meet a whole bunch of other people from all over. <laughs> and I bet that Hugo will only talk to girls. Players can enjoy their own individual play styles here. Hey, that sounds cool. We should hurry up and hop in, too. This is a lot different than Guardian training. The network world is vast and infinite. I hope we get to see each other there. Ladies, be sure to keep your eyes peeled for me. Now let's go! Everyone's waiting for us! Okay! But the online servers are gone! We can't go onto the network anymore! That, that was my favorite part of the game! Uh, <laughs> One day, they'll find a way to bring them back. Somebody will make a private server, I guarantee it, if they haven't already and I haven't found it. If you load this save data, you can keep your current level of items and start before the hive missions in chapter 2 and chapter 12. Okay, is it okay if I save on another file? Just to be on the safe side? I mean, will I ever play through this game again? I don't know. <sighs> but I hope you've all enjoyed this long delayed Let's Play. It's been fun, but we're finally done. Goodbye, everybody. Blood Spinning Lizard, out.